hello guys welcome and welcome back to my channel it's your girl kinesthetic and i'm here with you guys today with a new video So this video is going to be another organized with me video. So if you guys did not see my first video, I'll link it above. But I basically organized my work area. So if you guys did not see that video, check it out. But today I'm back with part two of my reorganizing my room series, I guess if that's what you want to call it. And in today's video, we're going to tackle this here which is on top of my set of drawers. This is basically where I keep all of my skin products, like body care, perfumes, and jewelry. So we'll be revamping this section right here. So if you guys want to see what I do, what I use, and the finished product, like the before and after, then go ahead and keep on watching. Before you get started, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel because we lit over here, okay? So just go ahead and subscribe. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy and drop a comment down below after you watch this entire video with your thoughts, with your comments, with your opinions, with any questions that y'all have, leave it down below. I'm over to spawning and without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. So I forgot to mention today is Sunday, April 26th. I like to have a timestamp on things like this so I can um, document how long it takes me to do things as well as if you guys want to do it too, you guys know how long things take because you might think like I'm doing all of this in a day. No, it's not getting done in a day. So patience is really a virtue when it comes to things like this specifically organizing so let's go ahead and get into the before Ooh, okay so this is my area on top of my set of drawers so these drawers it's kind of dirty don't mind my bra but i got this from ashley home furniture if i can find it i'll go ahead and link it down below um but up here i have all of my body products so all of my musu beauty if you have not tried musu beauty before then you are definitely missing out the best body body out body butter out and i have all of these musu beauties um bomb dot com i'll link it down below and then i have palmer's products for my skin I have my Dove deodorants, my Jergens lotion, and this head that I got from, where did I buy this from? I think I got this when I was in Malaysia. I don't remember, but I got this when I was on vacation as a souvenir for myself. And then I have this little thing which has my rings in it. I got this from Malaysia. <clears throat> my Bum Bum Creams. I have the yellow one and a turquoise one my flamingo collection so um if you ever went on vacation and asked what i wanted i always say something flamingo so i got this one for myself when i was in jamaica and my sister got me this one when she was in south africa so i just have my little collection right here and hopefully it can grow here i have all of my perfumes all of my perfumes all of the smell goods and then here i have garbage um, I have my nail, which is missing from right here, and my nail glue, so that when I gotta put it back on, I know where it is. Um, bottle of water that I always keep here. This is a lot of jewelry that we need to organize. And then I have two um, <coughs> photo books back here. Um, I do want to get into the habit of like printing more photos, to have memories. So I bought these two. I got them from Home Goods. So I have those two that. I have some photos in, but I do want to keep adding to the collection. And then I have all of my bracelets and necklaces and anklets and everything here. So we're going to reorganize this and make it just look way neater. Okay, so, so far I got this jewelry organizer from Amazon. And it's clear. It has these two small drawers and three larger four larger drawers oh crap i got four larger drawers drawers okay um but i do want to line them with the same non-adhesive grip um drawer liners that i used when i did my previous video so i'm gonna go ahead and line them first and then we'll figure out how we're going to organize it i didn't even know this that the drawers also came with um these papers we can put in to line it so maybe i'll just use these and it's already in like the perfect size to go in the drawer. So if it's perfectly. 
and it's like a felt material so what I'm doing is I'm putting the rough side at the bottom and then I'm putting the felt side up so that whatever we use can stick to it. Okay, so I went ahead and lined the drawers with the uh, materials that the stack of drawers came with. So really excited about that. It was super quick, super easy. Not sure if I mentioned this, but I got this from Amazon and it will be linked in my Amazon store down below in case you guys are interested. So yeah, this was step one. Now I'm going to go through my jewelry and see how I want to organize it. I think I might do like bracelets slash anklets in one and then do rings in here and probably like earrings in here but i also have the three by three cubes from story that i have left over from when i did my work area so i might use those for some like stud earrings and stuff too so we'll see but um yeah you guys will see me organize my jewelry now i don't want it to, it's right there by her playroom so i might be putting a lock on this door just to keep her out <laughs> Yeah, whole time I thought I was recording and I was not recording. So we're over here on my bed now. I'm organizing all of my earrings into pairs. Let me show you. Organizing all of my earrings into pairs because I feel like it'll just make it easier when it's time to organize it in our new organizer. So that's what I'm doing. But I feel like I always end up wearing the same earrings because I don't know where the other side is if I do find some cute earrings. But I just wanted to show y'all some cute ones that I found that I definitely forgot I had. I don't remember where I got these from, but it's been a while, so I don't think they're available anymore for me to tag them. But I have these yellow ones. I was obsessed with earrings at a point because I always wanted to do, like, makeup looks to match my earrings. But y'all know I do not know how to eyeshadow to save my life. I just be doing a little one-two, and it ends up looking cute. Y'all be liking it, so... We'll see. These, I think these are super cute drop earrings. Why is it not focusing? Okay, yeah. Cute drop earrings. These I just got from ASOS. I think these are super cute. So I'm just going through and I'm organizing them into pairs. Okay, so this is what I had my jewelry in before. It was real cute, but it wasn't functional, so it has to go. But I basically cleared everything out of here and laid everything out on my bed so I can see exactly what I am working with. Comment down below and let me know if you guys think I have a lot of earrings and accessories or an average amount. Ooh. Okay, so I went ahead and took my old jewelry organize it out and before i put my new one on i'm just gonna go ahead and clean with my clorox wipes y'all know the vibe yeah so i'm here cleaning up and I just wanted to show y'all real quick these two things I had. So I thought it was two photo albums, but I was wrong. This is how y'all know I have 
too much stuff because why am I confused about what I have? So this is the first one I have. It's a box actually. Ooh. It's a box and it says around the world. I got this from TJ Maxx for $7.99. But when you open it up, it basically just stores things and it says this book belongs to. But I just thought this was real cute, especially since y'all know I love to travel. So I'll leave this up here. I need to clean that wall. And then this one is an actual photo album. What I got in here? Oh, I have like some souvenirs from previous trips I went on. But I have no photos in here yet. But this is just a close-up look of what it is. It's like a map of the world. I think it's real cute. The brand of it is a Make Your Mark. So I'll see if I can find it online and link it down below. But these are the two items you guys saw I had up here. Okay, so this is how it looks up here now. I put the two the box and the photo album right here and next to it i have my jewelry organizer i'm not too too sure how i want to organize this yet so my plan slash vision is to get one of those swirly organizers and put that either on top or next to um this jewelry organizer so i can organize my skincare things like lotions body creams body butters all of that will be organized up here but i have so much space in front of here and i feel like i would want to put this somewhere here um this guy maybe like that i don't know so i'm gonna play around and see what i do and what it is and see how i can fix this up but for now i just want to go ahead and place my earrings and bracelets in here so that's what i'm going to do now Okay, so this is the first little corner that is fixed up. So I still think that I may put the little swirly thing on top of here and then move this once um, that comes. But I love how the area is open. I think I want to keep it like this versus having things, you know, all over. So I went ahead and organized my jewelry in here. So in here, I have all of my anklets. Just so you guys know, these jars do come out. So I thought it was easier for me to take it out, put the things in, and then place it back. So that's what I did. And here I have all of my bracelets. And then here I have all, oops, here I have all of my gold earrings, all of my silver earrings, and um, earrings that have like a heavy silver accent. Um, here I have colorful earrings, and then here are colorful earrings. So, all of this is organized. I kind of cleared this. So, this has like my chains and bracelets on it. So, I cleaned this up a little bit and threw away any jewelry that was like turning and all of that. So, that's basically... Uh, oh, I did one more thing. Hold on. <laughs> okay, so I also had these from when I did my... um work area organization these are three by three cubes from story um i believe i got a set of nine i want to say i'll go ahead and put it on the screen and link it down below but i think these are perfect for organizing jewelry versus organizing things in my work area because i found that as soon as i put one thing in here it was over so i separated these so these are like decorative hair clips that i have so flamingo pineapple and some earring backs and random earrings that i found while i was cleaning this has all of my stud earrings and um pins for like clothing here i have all of my big rings that you guys saw me separate out earlier and then in here are all of my smaller rings so these stack just like um the other organizers i had in my previous video so 
this just sits perfectly right here and this is how it looks nice and clean and organized i'm so happy but i'll be back once i get some more stuff and do more organizing so, okay guys let me see it's so dark okay my room is a little mess right now but it's okay i'm getting ready to um go take some pictures but i just got this jewelry organizer that i ordered from amazon so i'm about to build it as a part of my reorganization um jewelry area y'all will see what i will do with this but i'm about to build it real quick and then i'll be back okay so i went ahead and built my organizer yeah i love this so much okay so i'm done building my little swirly organizer i love it so much um i went ahead and put stuff in it already so um these little trays you can place them like at whatever level in here you want but i just wanted enough space for these to stand so i kind of like predetermined what i wanted to like how i wanted to organize it first and then i put these trays in so here at my deodorants musu beauty black owned body butter get you some um these are still empty i don't know what i'm gonna put here and this one has like this organizer section in it so i can put like little knickknacks here and also the top has a hole so if you want to put things to stand up you can do that too and then i have my sol de janeiro <laughs> creams here my palmers my palmers um and yeah so last thing i have to do is put these little hooks on like these things here so that they don't move and then tray doesn't fall the same place so i'm about to do that real quick and then i'm going to show you guys how i set up the final version of that area hey guys so this is the finished product of this organization section and i am so happy with it it's so much more organized so much decluttered like it's not a lot going on and it's also most importantly more functional so let's go ahead and walk through it so starting from the left i have my souvenir here i decided to put one here and then i put one up here um i have my two jergens lotions i don't really use these lotions like that they're almost done so once these are done then we'll have nothing here but for now i'm just gonna leave them right here i mean how black sheep is um next i put my box and my photo album against the wall and since they have like um like the tops are together i was able to put some stuff up here so i put uh, my other souvenir up here one of my flamingos and my little elephants and then over here we have my drawers with my earrings bracelets and anklets in them so you guys saw how i organized these drawers this is from amazon and i'll have a link down below but i just have everything organized in here and then i went ahead and put my little swirly action thingy up here this is also from amazon but it's so amazing i can just go ahead and spin and pick whatever i need and i also decided to put some of my perfumes in here so I have my Skylar Meadow, my YSL Opium, and my LOYSL Perfume in here. Just because I'll show you guys why in a few. Now moving over here, this is going to change. But for now, I'm not like too mad at it. So I just have my 3x3 three three cubes from Story stacked up here. Um, these were like leftovers from the orders that I made for my work area makeover. So um, most of these are empty. Um, the ones I do have things in them have like rings, um, little knickknacks, um, pins, brooches, whatever I have in here. Um, eventually I'm going to go ahead and use these other ones or other things as we do like the rest of my room. But for now I just have them here because it just looks, looks cute to me. Um, I have my other flamingo right here. And then behind my 3x3 three three cubes I have my bracelets and chains so here i could just go ahead and pick whatever i need and i don't have to like move this so yeah then i have this little glade candle here um i still haven't burned it um 
but it looks cute so i just left it here and then over here i have my smell goods so these are my perfumes if you guys do want to see a perfume collection comment down below and let me know i got this tray from home goods um it's just like a mirror tray with this um beaded lining um this tray was full like things were toppling over and i don't have time for my smell goods to be working so i went ahead and put some of them here which you guys saw and now everything fits in here comfortably so i just know that i cannot buy any more perfumes until i get rid of any so these are my perfumes if you guys want to see a perfume collection let me know but overall i am so happy i'm so pleased with how this organization project went comment down below and let me know what you think let me know what you guys like comment down below and let me know i hope you guys enjoyed this video before you head out make sure you subscribe we finally made it to 5k i just checked this morning so we'll be discussing that in tomorrow's video um give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy drop a comment down below and until tomorrow's video because i'm posting every day of quarantine okay baby so until tomorrow's video i will see you all later Mwah. and also i'll have another organization video coming up when i move on to the next corner of my room Bye!